Welcome to the tutorial on performing an annual review in the NIH Genetic Testing Registry, also known as GTR. In this video, we'll be reviewing GTR's annual review policies, how to update your lab information, how to update your test information, and how to perform the annual review. As participants in GTR, laboratories agree to review their information once a year, a process called the annual review. During the annual review, labs can update their laboratory and test information and confirm that their data is up to date, so clinicians looking for a test in GTR have access to accurate and up-to-date information. To view the GTR annual review policies, go to the link shown, which can also be found in the description below. To begin the annual review of your laboratory, log into the GTR submission portal to access your home page. The first step is to review and update the information for your lab. In the section Lab Information, click the Update Lab Information button and then click the Edit button. This opens a form with tabs. In the first tab, Lab Information, update the information, scroll down the page, and click the Save and Continue button. This takes you to the Personnel tab, where you can add or delete staff members. If you have any changes, make them here, and then click the Continue button. You are now in the Licensure and Accreditations tab, where you can update licenses and certifications and their expiration dates. Scroll down and click the Save and Continue button where you have made your changes. On the Default Parameters page, you can enter information common to many of the tests you will submit. This information pre-populates the corresponding fields on each new test, so you do not have to enter the same information multiple times. Later on, when you see this information on the test submission page, you can edit it as necessary. Scroll down and click the Save and Continue button when you've made your changes. Review your information and click the Submit button. You are then taken back to the GTR submission homepage. On the GTR submission homepage, go to the Tests in this lab section. Click the Manage Test button and go to the Manage Test tool. Here, you can use the Submission Portal Wizard to update tests perform bulk updates, and download selected tests. On the GTR submission homepage, click the Download Test button to download a spreadsheet with all the tests for your laboratory. You will receive an email with the link to the spreadsheet. Click the Submit Test button to go to the Submissions page. Here you can submit a new test using the Submission Wizard or to download spreadsheet templates and submit your spreadsheet. Please note that if you click the Manage Tests link to review and update your tests, the Submit Test link to submit new tests, or the Update Lab Information, these will take you away from the GTR Submission homepage. Once you are done updating your lab and or test data, you will need to come back to the GTR Submission homepage and submit the annual review. On the GTR Submission homepage, scroll down to the Annual Review section. Here you can see when the last review was performed and when the new one is due. Click the Perform an Annual Review button. Click Yes on the prompt and the pop-up to confirm you are ready to start the annual review. This opens the annual review form. If the button reads, Continue to Annual Review in Progress, it means that your lab has already started the annual review but has not submitted it yet. On the annual review page, you can see some information about your data, the review statuses of your tests, and some information about your lab. If your laboratory and test records are up to date, check the box that reads, I reviewed the list of tests and test information for accuracy and completeness. Then check the box that reads, I have reviewed the laboratory information for accuracy and completeness. Click the Complete Annual Review button and you are finished with your annual review.